Hi friends, in this video we are going to learn what is friction and also how rolling friction is less than static friction. Let me explain the concept of friction. If I roll this pencil, it will stop after some time. In the absence of friction, the pencil will keep rolling but it stops due to the resistance of the frictional force. Let us study what is sliding friction. It is a contact force that resists the sliding motion of two objects or an object and a surface. Let's see what is rolling friction. You can see the block is placed on these two pencils and it is not directly resting on the table. When one body rolls over the surface of another body, the resistance to its motion is nothing but rolling friction. Let us move on to the actual experiment where we are going to see how sliding friction is more than rolling friction. Here I have a weight of 50 gram and some slotted weights of 50 grams. Now we have placed the 50 gram as our applied force. Observe that the block is not moving which means the frictional force is more than the applied force. Now let us add one more slotted weight of 50 gram to the applied force. Can you observe that the block is still not moving? This means that the frictional force is more than the applied force of 100 grams. In the same way, I have added one more weight but still the block is not moving. Now I have added one more weight. Now let us see if the applied force is more than the frictional force. I have held the block purposefully just to explain you. If the applied force is more than the frictional force, the block will move. Do it one more time. The applied force is more than the frictional force, hence the block is moving forward direction. This means that the sliding friction is more than the applied force which is 150 gram. Let's move on to the experiment for rolling friction. I am going to use these two pencils. Also remove the two weights. So now the applied force is only 50 gram. Convert this into rolling friction. I will place these pencils below the block. Now the applied force is only 50 gram. And if I release my finger, let's see whether it will move or not. I am going to release my finger slowly. So that the 50 gram is applied on the block. And see it is moving horizontally. Let us do it one more time. For the first reading itself, the block started to move. Which means that the rolling friction is less than 50 grams. From this experiment, we understand that rolling friction is less than sliding friction. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it.